Hi guys! Today you will find out what planets other than our own may have life on them. And the first planet is Proxima b, which is about 4.24 light years away. That's about 39 trillion kilometers. Just think how far away that is. Let's see why life is possible on this planet. Proxima b is at a distance from its star at which conditions for liquid water to exist on the planet's surface are possible. If Proxima b has a similar chemical composition to Earth, it could provide the resources and elements necessary for life to form. But there's also a reason why life on this planet could be difficult due to the fact that the planet is around a red dwarf, which is low emitting and could create an unfavorable environment for life due to intense radiation and strong solar flares. Because the star is low emitting, it's quite cold on the planet. And also Proxima b has high gravity, which people should also take into account. Overall, there is a 40% chance of life on this planet. So let's introduce a flag for Proxima b. First of all, the flag will have a blue background, symbolizing water. In the center will be a silver circle, symbolizing the planet itself. And the unusual yellow figure around the circle will symbolize the star that's around the planet. The stars around the emblem speak of the planet's connection to the stars. The flag is wonderful. By the way, what will the inhabitants of this planet look like? The average height of a person would be about the same as on Earth. People would be well-proportioned, with well-developed musculature and a physique suitable for adapting to the physical conditions of the planet. Skin would be more pigmented to protect against potentially more intense radiation. Eyes would have more developed twilight vision because of the dim light on the planet. Human hair, because of the cold climate on the planet, would be similar to wool. Arms and legs may be more adapted for movement due to painful gravity. Our next planet is only 1.6 times the size of Earth and it's Kepler 452b. The distance from Earth is about 1,400 light years. Life on this planet is possible because the planet is in the habitable zone of its star, indicating the presence of water. The star Kepler 452 is classified as a yellow dwarf, which is the same star type as the Sun and is quite bright. The planet is in a stable orbit, which contributes to the conditions for life for a long time. But there's also a reason that makes life on this planet difficult. Namely, the planet can experience phenomena such as high temperatures, strong winds or extreme climate fluctuations due to the unstable atmosphere. Besides, people will have to adapt to the high gravity on the planet. The probability of life on this planet can be estimated at about 85%. What about the flag? The background will be white as a sign that this is the new beginning for humanity. In the center of the flag will be an emblem, which consists of four parts of different colors, each with its own meaning. Dark blue symbolizes the depth of cosmos. Green symbolizes the nature. Yellow symbolizes the prosperity of the planet. And gray symbolizes the Milky Way. The flag is well made and is appropriate for such a planet. Let's talk about the inhabitants of Kepler 452b. Because of the high gravity, humans may have more developed musculature or stronger bone structure to maintain mobility and stability under such conditions. The skin would have to be dark to protect them from the intense radiation of the star. The hair would also be darker for the same reason or have a special texture to retain heat. Our next planet is about 40 light years away from Earth in the constellation of Aquarius. Let's talk about TRAPPIST-1e. So why does this planet show signs of life? Habitable zone. TRAPPIST-1e is in the habitable zone of its star TRAPPIST-1, which means it may have liquid water. TRAPPIST-1e is similar to Earth in terms of size and mass. This could create the same conditions for life as on Earth. The very fact that there are many planets in the TRAPPIST-1 system, including TRAPPIST-1e, increases the possibility of life. Interaction between the planets could create favorable conditions for the evolution of life. Radiation on TRAPPIST-1e can be pretty high because of its proximity to TRAPPIST-1, which is a red dwarf. Red dwarfs emit intense ionizing radiation, which can be dangerous. Also, the dwarf is very dim. Because of this, the human vision would have to adapt to the dimness of the planet. And also, the gravity there is pretty strong, to which humans would also need to adapt. The probability of life on this planet can be estimated at about 50%. So let's come up with a flag for this planet. First of all, the flag will have a green background, symbolizing nature on the planet. In the center will be a circle divided into two parts, each of a different color. So let's imagine what the sad inhabitants would look like. 
Because of the higher gravity, people on TRAPPIST 1E would have a more compact body with short limbs to reduce the load on the skeletal system. Their skin would have dark pigmentation to protect them from the ultraviolet radiation. They would also have more advanced night vision to adapt to the light on the planet.